what's up you guys so i wanted to talk to you guys today about mastering your didactic year so that is what we're going to be talking about in this video i'm going to give you a tool that i think is really the ultimate tool to your success so let's get into the video right now What's up, you guys? It's Adana. Welcome back to my channel. Okay, so like I said, this video is going to be about mastering your didactic year. Now, didactic year can be very difficult. You're doing a lot of studying, um, you're getting a lot of information, and it can be difficult to process and then kind of like also go over and keep in your mind. So um, I wanted to talk to you about the didactic cue bank that Ross Review has. Now, obviously, um, if you've seen some of my other videos, I've actually done a video on this, but I wanted to do a little bit more like of a deep dive, a more in-depth review slash kind of tutorial about this particular cue bank. So you can see all of the various different things that you have at your disposal that will help you not only master di didactic gear, but really like succeed in didactic gear. So let's take a look at the QBank and I'll show you exactly what I'm talking about. So this is the desktop version of Ross Review. You would go to the PA section and go to the didactic gear. Here in the didactic gear section, you would have not only your didactic gear exams, but you would have access to also purchase the clinical EKG QBank. This allows you to just kind of get more familiar with EKGs and just be more comfortable with them. When you sign into the interface, you'll see just an overall view of what you've done so far. And then they'll also have various different exams that you can either purchase or those that you can obtain for free, which is a really nice feature that they do offer in these boost exams and just kind of testing your knowledge with respect to what you've learned thus far in PA school and kind of what you've learned while doing the various different Ross Review Cube Banks. To create your own exam, you just go to the Create Your Exam tab. You want to make sure that you're in the right Cube Bank because there are several different Cube Banks that they offer. So I'm in the Didactic Year Cube Bank. I'm going to name my test. Something simple is really all you need. And I'm gonna just do five questions because I wanna show you what it what it offers. You can do test or tutor mode. Tutor mode will give you answers and then you can choose if you want all or used, unused items, flagged items, or items that you've missed. You can also decide whether or not it's timed. Another really cool feature is that you can use it across your different technologies. So you can use it with your tablet or with your cell phone, which is actually a really nice feature to have it as an app so that you're able to have it right at your fingertips when you're on the go. It still has the same setup. You can still see the tests you've paid for and the exams that you've already started. Here you can also review the exams you've started or do one that's already in progress. I like this feature that gives you a cumulative um, just view of your overall performance. It shows you your probability of passing the boards, how you're faring on the particular blueprint content, how you fare with different age demographics, and the various different question types, which is really nice so that it helps you better prepare for not only your didactic year exams, but your board exams. So as you can see, the question bank really is a very nice way to not only truly like get your answers and questions and test your knowledge, but reinforce that knowledge as well with the explanations and the diving further into um, your like your little extra nuggets of questions. Um, it's really a benefit. And I know for me, like I didn't have the didactic year cue bank and I wish I did, but I was able to use Ross Reviews cue bank to help test me and reinforce that knowledge. Um, it's also really has benefits that go beyond just like your individual study. And so you can use this cue bank to not only study in your individual small setting, but in a small group setting where you're able to bounce these questions off of each other, um, off of the other individuals in your group, so that you're able to actually not only like see like what your train of thought is, but what some of your classmates train of thought is. And you guys can discuss why you thought the answer was what it was and you know, why it may not have been what it was. Let's take another look at the QBank and I'll show you like some of the really cool features that I like about this QBank. 
So one of my favorite features is the fact that you get an explanation when you submit your answer. And this is really in the tutor mode. It shows you why your answer is correct and why the other answers are incorrect. It also gives you a peer comparison so you can see how you fear against your peers that are taking the exam. And it gives you a picture of the material. Um, it also allows you to just kind of go one step further with the various different questions, which is such a benefit when going into your clinical year of PA school. You also have the opportunity to pause your exam and restart it at a later time if you so choose, which is a nice option. Lastly, I wanted to show you this option right here, which I think is a game changer. You can actually type in any subject matter that you want into the search bar and then search for it. That way you will be able to see all of the various different content on that particular material that you're asking about. And you can choose to go in and look at the question, look at the scenario so you can see why that particular answer or subject matter pertains to this particular scenario and it still gives you the information of going one step further. This is really, really great for not only your didactic year learning, but for also your clinical year learning. Because if you're being asked a question or if you have seen something on your clinical year, that you were unfamiliar with or heard something that you were unfamiliar with, you can simply just type it in to the search bar and then all of the different content that is across Roche Reviews QBank will be pulled and you can choose to see, hey, look, why is it this? Why does it pertain to that? Why is this information um, preeclampsia? And it's really, really a benefit for you because this allows you not only to reinforce information that you may already be fully aware of, but it also gives you the uh, opportunity to truly learn information and just kind of grasp the various different concepts that you're learning, not only in didactic year, but being able to now apply it to your clinical year. So this feature right here is truly a game changer. So as you can see, the question bank is not only useful in your learning and didactic year, but you can really translate it and use it to reinforce what you've learned in a clinical year as well. When you're going through these rotations and getting pimped by your various different preceptors on questions in particular um, rotations and specialties. So ultimately with dedication and studying and the right tools like this particular Q bank that Ross Review offers for your didactic year, you can not only like succeed in didactic year, but truly conquer didactic year, okay? So uh, if you have any of the questions for me, leave them in the comment section below. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Follow me on Instagram at the PA and on Instagram at Get That C University. We have some like fresh revamps coming. So hopefully you can start mastering your didactic year um, today with the use of Rosh Reviews QBank. And I wish you many blessings on your journey.